We begin with several breaking stories in the coronavirus pandemic. The attendance rate in the city schools is so low, Mayor Adams is considering a remote option. Also this afternoon, the Supreme Court blocked a vaccine or test rule from the administration, the Biden administration, for U.S. businesses. And military medical teams are being deployed to three tri-state area hospitals. All this as the number of COVID deaths continues to climb. Another 195 in New York, 117 in New Jersey. Let's begin tonight with the attendance rate at city schools. Wednesday, 76% of nearly 1 million students enrolled attended class. CBS 2's Dick Brennan live in our newsroom with reaction from the mayor and teachers. Dick? Well, Christina Maurice, and that number has been lower on other days. The mayor has been insistent on keeping schools open, but now they're getting a look at a remote option. The chancellor says they need to make a deal with the teachers' union to make it happen, but the union says they favored it all along. And should we create a remote option? What should that look like? That's something we're trying to work on right now. Schools Chancellor David Banks says the reason the city is looking at a remote option is that so many kids are not showing up for school. My goal is to create an option that would take us at the very least to the end of the school year, right? Um, not just for two weeks or something, because it takes... It, it, this is not an easy thing to just roll out a remote option. Attendance at schools on Wednesday was 76%, with one school as low as 41%. We can resolve this, we can get through this crisis, and we will find the right way to educate our children in a very safe environment. And if we're able to put in place a temporarily remote option, we're welcome to do so. Sources tell CBS2 that Chancellor Banks, UFT President Michael Mulgrew, and officials from City Hall are meeting on the matter right now. In his statement, Mulgrew said, We have long called for an instructionally sound remote option and have been speaking directly to the mayor about creating one, a program that will work for students. Well, at least until we get everything under control in the next few weeks, I think it's a good idea for a temporary um, position. Some parents we spoke to thought a remote option is a good idea. Lynette Godfrey says her son has a heart condition and she'd feel much better if he wasn't in class. I would want my son to stay home for the moment until this is like they have another alternative about this COVID. But others say it's just not good for the kids. Remote learning doesn't really work. The kids get a less of an education than if they went to the school. Now, if a plan is agreed upon, it's not clear when it could be rolled out. Banks says he needs to work out the details with the teachers union. Dick Brennan, CBS 2 News. Okay, Dick, thank you.